Howdy, partners. Uh, I'm here to apologize uh, to all of you. Say, <laughs> oh, yes, you know. No, I am. Look, I am uh, so. So in a uh, good mood because uh, I realized that uh, that CD Projekt Red the pricks finally gave up. Yeah, those degenerate asshole, degenerate uh, Chinese uh, CDPR. Uh, they're already given up. How? Because uh, they've been called out by Bethesda and Volition. Yeah. In uh, the debate uh, about the companies. And of course, uh, Volition already proved that, uh, that the Saints Row 2022 already did much better than uh, Cyberpunk 2077. It even made uh, the Cyberpunk fan quit the Cyberpunk uh, just to jump straight to Saints Row 2022. Yeah, it's just proof how good Saints Row uh, 2022 is. In fact, even Bethesda. Bethesda also... Um, Called out the the CD Projekt Red, but Vesta and Volition both called out the CD Projekt Red, and proved that the uh, Cyberpunk uh, is one of the worst uh, game, and it will never win in a game of the year at all. Well, sadly, neither uh, Saints Row 2022 will either win in a game of the year, but at least it's better than. Than the Cyberpunk 2077. But let me tell you who's gonna win in a game of the year. Uh, it's Starfield and uh, Assassin's Creed Odyssey. Oh, yeah. So, yeah, after the CD Projekt Red uh, were called out by Volition and Bethesda, people are not just uh, decided. To quit the Cyberpunk, also they quit the, and uninstall the the Witcher, and jump straight to the the Assassin's Creed Odyssey. Yeah, because uh, even Assassin's Creed Odyssey is so much better than than the Witcher, and uh, it already de already beat it Witcher in the Game of the Year too. Just like Starfield uh, already beat it the Cyberpunk in the Game of the Year in 2024, uh, even 2023 Saints Row 2022. Uh, uh, beat it Cyberpunk in the game of the year. Yeah. But, uh, in 2024, uh, Starfield beat it, uh, Saints Row 2022 in the game of the year. That's right. And, uh, of course, it even made, uh, CD Projekt Degenerate, uh, uh, finally give up. Give up, um, give up uh, anything. Uh, well, because uh, the CD Projekt Red already went broke. They already went broke. Uh, you know that? Uh, because they spent so much money on uh, on a stupid cast eye. Yeah, no kidding. Uh, the CD Projekt Red already spend their own money on a stupid uh, uh, KSI. Yeah, I'll be, of course, uh, they they spent too much money on uh, on a KSI song called "Think of It." Yeah, CD Projekt Red they wasted all of their money just to donate to to the garbage ass uh, song uh, "Think of It" that came from uh, a degenerate KSI. Yeah. Most people hated the KSI song 
but CD Projekt Red, they're the only one who donated their money and shillings to to uh, KSI just for that garbage ass uh, thick of his song. Much as they they wasted their money on that dog shit uh, update uh, uh, 2.0 uh, patch, which is completely worthless. So yeah, CD Projekt Red gave up. They they're giving up because they have no other choice that they have to give up. They're already already exposed, already exposed uh, by uh, by even his own fan, which is all thanks to the volition, all thanks to Bethesda. Yeah, they both called out the uh, the CD Projekt Red, just like uh, how uh, uh, down to the end, uh humiliated to uh, uh, KSI uh, yeah yeah so uh, yeah um give up give up the city project red and I, I bet uh, the rest of the Chinese nationalist uh, cyberpunk fans will absolutely cry and lose their own shit just after they realize that the CD Projekt Red have finally given up and finally been humiliated by, by Volition and Bethesda. Yeah! Yeah, CD Projekt Red already been humiliated. They've been crushed by by Volition and uh, Bethesda. And yeah, they even, in fact, Volition also proved how rubbish uh, the Witch uh, is too. Yeah, they, they proved that the Witcher is also the rubbish. In fact, uh, Assassin's Creed Odyssey, uh, it's made by Ubisoft, but at least uh, it's ten times even better than than uh, the Witcher. I mean, I'm not saying that uh, all uh, uh, games in Ubisoft are rubbish. Uh, not all of them are rubbish. Well, of course, I really hate the uh, Assassin's Creed Shadows. Much as I hate the Assassin's Creed uh, uh, Mirage, and uh, I don't even like uh, Assassin's Creed Valhalla. But Ubisoft, at least uh, they did have the best Assassin's Creed uh, series that's made back in uh, uh, 2018. Is the Odyssey? Odyssey is one of the best Assassin's Creed game is. Uh, yeah, yeah, best Assassin's Creed game. Yeah, it's absolutely, it's absolutely f fire. Yeah. That Assassin's Creed Odyssey is goaded. Yeah, it's so goaded. Made by Ubisoft. Uh, of, of course, the uh, Assassin's Creed Odyssey is made by Ubisoft, but... It's the best Assassin's Creed uh, series ever. I've really been looking for uh, uh, an ancient Rome or Greek mythology open world uh, uh, stealth game. Uh, yeah. Until I realized that they had Assassin's Creed Odyssey. But even the fate of Atlantis is goaded. Yes, Fate of Atlantis is one of the best uh, DLC in uh, Assassin's Creed Odyssey. It's it's goaded, no joke. The the Fate of Atlantis uh, is so goaded. This is why I bought it and I never regret it. It does so much better than The Witcher, which is just rubbish. You know that. And, of course, uh, 
CD Projekt Red, they always are the KSI mode, while I'm always on the Dad TDM uh, mode. My always colleague, uh, the degenerate CDPR out, exposes the hell out of uh, the Cyberjunk 2077, much as I expose the hell out of uh, the rubbish uh, witch. Uh, And yeah, I am not a big fan of uh, a rubbish ass uh, uh, medieval games. I no, I like the Greek mythology, ancient Rome game way better than than uh, than a medieval. Uh, yeah, th this is why. Uh, sorry, I was. I was just stretching uh, my neck. Just stretch my neck. Yeah, it hurts over there. But, uh... Yeah. This is all I had. I don't know if I got something else. Ah. Hmm. And, um, oh yeah, uh, please uh, subscribe to uh, uh, Blacks Did Witcher, which is my second channel. Oh yeah, I, uh, because I have tried to uh, uh, stream, uh, but only with my uh, second channel. But I can't, because my second channel uh, barely had any subscribers and I had no subscribers I beg it to all of my own subscribers to also subscribe to my second channel and then I could finally um, uh, stream with my second uh, channel and I don't have to stream with my first uh, channel because uh, I've I've streaming uh, the Assassin's Creed uh, Odyssey Fate of Atlantis just to prove how it does better than uh, the rubbish Witcher better than the uh, Witcher series if, uh, In fact if the Witcher uh, made by Volition instead of uh, CD Projekt Red it would never been that rubbish Yeah But yeah well, guess what, uh, CD Projekt Red? You lost. This is what happened if you if you always scam the folks, lie too much, and uh, never admit uh, that that your games are ass. Never admit that your games are rubbish. And you, you never even apologize to anybody uh, that you scammed them. Well, guess what? You lost everything. You lost your money. You lost. Uh, you lost your career. You lost your resources. And of course, you wasted your own time. In fact, this is also what happened if you. If you uh, donate too much money on uh, that uh, case, I uh, saw go think of it. Yeah. Yeah, you should be ashamed of yourself, uh, CD Projekt Red. CD Projekt Red should be ashamed of themselves. But no, they've always been shameless. But yeah, yeah, this is what happened. This is what happened. Uh, they lost everything. Oh yeah, that the wonder why you have uh, CD Projekt Red. Uh, they clearly lost everything. Uh, yeah, because they always be shameless and always uh, liars, always degenerate, and always, uh, always uh, a scammers.
lied to themselves, manipulating uh, everybody, uh, deluding, um, deluding them as well. I was deluded uh, just for once back in 2021, but uh, one month later, not anymore. Uh, I am not uh, deluded by the Chinese uh, CDPR cultist. I feel so free. And, uh, Manipulation and scamming and lying and deluding uh, your own fans will make you absolutely lose everything but at least it never got uh, even as worst uh, as uh, as uh, uh, Alex Jones back in the days yeah like uh, it's not it's not politic it's not political I'm not trying to be political yeah I promise I am not trying to be political um, I'm just uh, here to shit on uh, the CD Projekt Red. Yeah, and uh, yeah, that's what happened. And uh, of course, uh, I I caught the. Uh, uh, one uh, tweet from the CD Projekt Red, it said, I can't believe that I just be called out to uh, and lost everything. And it's all because of you, Volition. And then a cry emoji. Yeah. They admit that they're hurt. They are, they've been roasted and burned. That call out uh, from uh, Volition is absolutely brutal. But this is what CD Projekt Red get for, for lying and scamming and deluding uh, his own fans. Scamming his own fans as well, just like uh, Logan Paul. <sighs> when will you ever learn uh, CDPR? But I, I, of course, uh, doesn't mean um, I will ever be sorry to uh, to the Chinese uh, CDPR. They absolutely deserve to lose everything. For deluding his own fan, lying to themselves, lying to the old people. In fact, uh, like uh, old people, I mean like his old fan. You know what I mean? But anyway, of course, uh, they, also, they also scam uh, their own fan. This is what they get. This is what they get. In fact, they, they try to... Uh, uh, they try to build uh, more ch Chinese nationalism, uh, even in the United States. Uh, I'm not talking about the KFT, I'm talking about a Chinese communist. Uh, CDPR, a huge fan of the Chinese communist. That they're, they're building their own uh, communism in the uh, United States by downloading his own fan and scamming them. But uh, don't, uh, uh, don't think that uh, that uh, they don't care about the money. Oh, they care about the money. Uh, CDPR, of course, they're pro-communist, but but still loves money. They love shilling. They love shilling so much. They are they are uh, greedy as hell. But. Uh, of course, they are the biggest Chinese nationalist communist, acting like a capitalist, but 
They're scammers. You know that Chinese communism is also a scam. Cares about the money, acting like you're a capitalist. And yeah. The biggest degenerate uh, manipulating pricks. Uh, finally, been called out by uh, a volition. In fact, uh, here's another tweet from, from uh, the volition. It said, CDPR is no match for the saints. Yes, that absolutely hurts the hell out of the CDPR. Acting like a Christian, a Chinese nationalist who's acting like a Catholic, not a true Christian. You're not a true Christian, so stop admitting that you're a true Christian. I'm talking to all of the Chinese nationalists to stop admitting that you're Christian because I know that you're not a Christian if you're defending a Chinese communism and nationalism. You're always clearly defending a Chinese socialism. So stop admitting that you're Christian because I know you're not Christian. Anybody who defends the Chinese uh, socialism are not a Christian at all, calling themselves a Christians. Yeah. Look, and, uh, and, uh, saints, uh, not always had to do with the Catholic. Well, uh, no, no, it's a different type of saints. I'm talking about a different type of saints. I'm talking about the... Uh, the saints rose spirits, not the Catholic spirits. Um, I'm not Christian, I'm not religious, but I'm a saint. I'm a saint, but uh, not uh, not a Christian, not a Catholic. I'm a saint, though. Saint saints are always different than Christians. The card is similar to the Christians, but but they're not necessarily a Christians. Uh, Saints, it's, uh, it's the Saints Rose Gang. That, that's exactly the name of that. So, yeah. Saints, uh, is the name of, uh, the Purple Gangs. The Purple, uh, YouTube Gangs. And this is me. I am. I am True Saints. Because I, I've always wear purple. To prove I'm a saint. To prove I'm always a saint. I wear purple all the time just to prove I'm a saint. But. If you're not wearing a purple. You ain't no saint. To prove that you're a saint. You must wear purple every day. Any time you want to go outside, make sure to wear purple just to prove to anybody that you're a saint. So anybody will believe that you're truly a saint. Yeah. Well, like I said, saints are not uh, a Catholic. Saints is, uh, it's not even a religion, it's just the name of the purple gang. It's the name of the gang who's wearing a purple. And of course, uh, you guys are all welcome to join my gang. My gang will be the Saints. Of course, I sighed for it. I sighed uh, to make my own gang. Uh, called the Saint. And I'm so glad that I've earned uh, tons of respect. 
after calling out uh, the degenerate uh, CD project cred so many times. Yeah, I saw, I saw it went viral. It proves that I've earned a respect. I've earned a respect just like in Saints Row style. Yeah, of course, Saints Row style respect. I've earned a respect just like in Saints Row. Yeah. And like I said, like I said, Please subscribe to Blackstead Witcher, my second uh, channel. Uh, with, well, yeah, both of our channel, of course, they 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 were called the Witcher, but uh, but it's the Volition, uh, it's the Volition character. Which uh, remember that uh, just because my name is Witcher doesn't mean uh, my channel is made by CDPR. No. My channel is made by Volition. Even Blackstead, which uh, uh, is also made uh, uh, by uh, Volition. Yeah. In fact, of course, uh, 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 Witcher from Volition, uh, it's so much better than uh, Witcher from uh, uh, City Project Red. But speaking of that, even uh, Conan Exile... Uh, one of the best uh, uh, fantasy, uh, uh, Greek mythology, uh, Roman mythology, uh, open world uh, survival game ever. Because it's made by Volition. Uh, yeah. Uh, yeah. Um, what is it called? What is it called again? Uh, I forgot what is it called again. Um, um, is it Coded Exile? Coded Exile uh, is uh, made by Volition, and I hope uh, you guys enjoyed watching this channel. Uh, you can leave all of the dislike and hateful uh, comments, longest. Uh, Long as you're not, uh, um, long as you're not, uh, endorsing, uh, the Cyberpunk 2077. Uh, because it's a, it's my channel policy. And, uh, do not insult, the uh, uh, Saints Row 2022, and do not insult, uh, Bethesda, and do not insult, uh, uh, uh Starfield. The, those are the... Those are the policy in my channel, in a comment. But you guys can insult me whatever you want, and and also I do not have autism. I'm a normal person. So yeah, you can yeah you can insult me whatever you want. You can you can leave uh, all of the dislike uh, whatever the hell you want. Yeah.